excited to do my October beauty obsessions. Um, I have a whole bunch of stuff here, yeah. So hopefully um, you can bear with me because there's so many, so many favorite things that I absolutely love that I have here that I want to share with you guys. These are just all my favorite products, everything from hair to face to nails. I simply remember my favorite things and then I don't feel so bad. I'm kind of sad because October is my favorite month I think out of the whole year. And that's sad. The very close, I mean I love Christmas too but um, I love Halloween and it's just, yeah, I don't know, I just love the colors and the leaves and now all the, le all the trees have no leaves on them. Like, oh, so sad. Alright, so let's get started. I think I'm going to start with the hair products first. As you, if you don't know, I absolutely love this. This is the Aussie 3 Minute Miracle. Um, and it's just, I just keep buying it over and over again. This is probably my fourth or fifth bottle. I just repurchased this at Mar uh, Walmart. You probably seen this in my Walmart haul if, if you've watched my Walmart haul. Um, but I absolutely love this stuff. It is like literally just three dollars or sometimes it's under three dollars. So this is so affordable and it's just great and it Oh, it smells so good, so absolutely love it. My absolute favorite, favorite, favorite deep conditioner. Okay, and my other two favorite products for my hair. I have to give major props because I love Scorch Goff. Oh, I always kill that, butcher that name. Scorch Goff got to be um, products I love. I love, love, love their hair products. I'm like obsessed. Um, and this is the Smooth Operator. Um, sort of like frizz control lotion and it comes in this adorable bottle. I'm so obsessed with this bottle. It is just like the cutest thing ever. Yeah, I love it with little charms here. And this is the Smooth Operator Smoothing Satin Drops. So this is like the finishing product that you would use. And I just love it. I just love these two products. This one is around around six around six dollars and this one here was around like five something so very affordable and you get a huge bottle like I use this all the time and uh, there's like it's like still full and these smell so good oh my god it smells like not perfume but it's just ah oh, it's just so luxurious it smells so luxurious and fancy and I just love it and it's just so affordable and the bottles are so cute Okay, moving on to the face. Um, okay, so this is my absolute favorite face wash. This is from Aveeno, and this is the Smart Essentials Pore Purifying Face Wash. And the scent of this, you guys, oh my god. I think that's what made me buy it, because the scent is just amazing. Oh my god, like every time I put it on my face, it just, it really perks you up. It makes you feel good. It puts you in a good mood. I love things that smell good that really make you feel good too. Is around six dollars depending on where you go. I know Vino is kind of on the expensive side. It is the one product that I will splurge on because I really do love the Aveeno products for my face because I have really sensitive skin and this seems to be gentle. It does what it's supposed to do. It removes any excess dirt, oil, makeup that's in your pores on your skin. Love it great stuff. This right here is my favorite facial lotion and I do use the I do use the Aveeno one, the Ultra Call Me one, but I've noticed that sometimes it feels too heavy on my skin and sometimes I wonder if that doesn't also break me out and I don't use it that often, but once in a while if I'm like out in the sun cuz it does have SPF in it. Um this does not, but this is um and I use this at nighttime mostly. This is the Simple brand and I really love their stuff. They have two different types of lotions. And this is the light moisturizer and they do have like a heavier moisturizer. I opted for the light moisturizer because I wanted something light, not heavy. Something that's not going to clog my pores and something that's very gentle. This has no perfume, no dyes. Um, it has vitamins in it. And yeah, I mean, this is just a really great moisturizer. This was a little bit of a splurge for me. I was a little bit disappointed in the price. It was about $10. Yeah, maybe I, I should have hunted around for a better deal, but I really needed a facial lotion, so I 
I, I thought I would try it. So it is $10, but you do get a big bottle. It's a 4.2 full ounce. I highly recommend this for you guys. If you have very sensitive skin, definitely check out this Simple Brand product. The other thing I really love from the Simple Brand is their makeup remover cloth. Oh. I've had the hardest time finding facial wipes that don't irritate my eyes. Um, the Neutrogena ones burn, Almay, um... There's so many different brands. I've tried off-brand, I've tried Pons, I've tried... I mean, just about everything burns my eyes, and these do not... Oh my gosh, you guys. So if you have sensitive skin and if you have a hard time with makeup wipes burning your eyes, definitely check these out. But normally I think they're around four something. So very affordable. Love these. So obsessed. I'm so obsessed with it. Can't get it. Ooh, 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 ooh. Okay, so my favorite, absolute favorite hand lotion, if you guys don't know, um, is the Bert, Burt's Bees Beeswax Hand Cream. It's got like the almond milk. It's got the little cow in the front. And I just love this. I know this is, I think this is in my last um, Beauty Obsessions for September video, but I just love it so much. It smells so good and it just makes me feel good. It's something about that smell and just takes me back to my childhood. This is $9, but, um, I mean, I bought this, like, two, what, two months ago or something, and, you know, you need just a tiny, tiny amount to put on your hands. Love this lotion. Oh, just love it. Another really favorite hand lotion of mine, and I don't see too many people talk about them, but I absolutely love these EOS hand lotions, and they come in these really cute little bottles like this, and I think there's one other scent, but... A one that's non-scented, but I have the ones that are scented. And I have um, cherry, or cherry, <laughs> berry blossom and cucumber. Yeah, they're so cute. You just open it up right here. And yeah, these are handy. I love throwing them in my purse and my hands get dry. In the wintertime, I use tons of hand lotion. They're very affordable. They're around like $3.24 each, something like that. But I love these. These are just Great. This on my hands. Ooh. Okay, now we're getting into the beauty products. Ah. So my absolute favorite foundation right now is the uh, Maybelline Dream Smooth Mousse. And it looks like this. And it's just the cutest little container. I'm talking so much, guys. I'm sorry. But you open it up and there's a little sponge there. I don't use that. But that's just for looks. Oh, my bird. Can you hear him? Listen. Every time I shoot in a video, I have to go in there and kind of like tell them, hey, shh, keep it down. Anyway, so this is what it looks like on the inside. It's really, really creamy. If you guys want me to do like a more detailed review on this foundation, I can do that. Just leave a comment down below. But I absolutely love this foundation. And yeah, I just love it. Right, that bird is just driving me crazy. Let me go get him. Okay, somebody wants some attention. So... This is Buddy, and he is always interrupting my videos. You naughty boy. Say hi, everybody. Say hi. Oh, say. Oh, you love to whistle, don't you? You're always interrupting my videos. You're always interrupting my videos. Yes, you are. We have makeup to do. We have to talk about makeup and products. Look, he loves his head scratch. He loves it. Yes. Oh, say so that feels good, mama. All right, I'm gonna go put him away. Okay, <laughs> back to the video. Sorry about that, guys. I just, I had to get him out for a minute so he'll be quiet. Okay, so my absolute favorite facial, like, powder. Um, I cannot live without this. This Day Matte Pressed Powder from Momo London. And I absolutely love this stuff. It's my absolute favorite, favorite powder. I mean, it's just makes my skin look silky smooth. This is what it looks like. The only thing I can say is I don't like the packaging. I mean, it's not going to go anywhere. Luckily, I haven't had any issues, but it just sets on top. Like, that's it. This is so affordable, you guys. It's like under $5, so I highly recommend this product. Love it. 
Now my absolute favorite like bronzer right now. I am loving contouring blush and bronzing powder duo. I'm sure you guys have heard about these. But this is the one in, this is the St. Lucia one. This is one of the newer shades. And I love this because it is perfect for my skin tone. As you can see, it's like the lightest shade of bronze and blush out of the other ones. The other ones are so dark. I was like, eh, that ain't gonna look good on me. There we go. There you go. That's what the colors look like. They're just gorgeous. I thought about doing a review on these, but I don't know if you guys want to see that or not. So put a comment down below if you want me to do a video on those. $3. <sighs> So this is going to be kind of surprising to you guys, but I don't think LA color LA colors gets enough um, like hype and recognition because I was at the dollar store the other day and I picked this up for one dollar and this is from LA Colors and this is um, 12 color eyeshadow palette and it's in the shade Trendy. So that's the name of this palette. It's called Trendy and they had many different ones and I thought I would get the warm. Ooh, I thought I would get the warm palette since it's fall and winter and that. I really wanted to get some warm shades. So look at this, guys. Uh, oh, <laughs> always falls out. Comes with these beautiful 12 warm, like, brown shades. And let me just say, I'm actually wearing them today on my eyes. And they blend amazingly well. They're beautiful. The only downside would be is that they do tend to get a little bit of fallout. I just want to show you like how pigmented this is. Like look, I mean the colors are just beautiful. Look at that orange. Look at that. I mean it's just so pigmented. I just love it and I love this one too. This is like the highlight. Look at that. So pigmented. I'm loving this palette and only for one dollar. If you're on a really tight budget, girl, I'm telling you, you need to really check these out. One dollar. One dollar. No. I mean, shut the front door. Get out of town. So for the month of October, I recently purchased this towards the end of October. But I had to throw it in here because it's my absolute favorite color. Oh my god. Um, this is from Sally Hansen. It's called Diamond Strength. Their Diamond Strength line. And this is in the shade Save the Date. And you've probably seen this in my Walmart haul. I could not help myself. These are so affordable. Go to Walmart. You will find the best deals on nail polish. It's like this. Oh my god. I've been looking for a color like this for so long. It's got like that maroon, purple, burgundy, deep color. But it's really rich. And I'm actually wearing it on my nails right now. Um, sorry if they look a little bit crappy. <laughs> um... But yeah, I'm wearing it right now on my nails and I just love it. The color is just gorgeous. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. So my favorite mascaras right now, guys. I am loving this. This is from e.l.f. This is the mascara primer. And I'm not really into like primers and stuff. But this is amazing. Oh my god. Like you put this on um, before you apply your mascara. It can be any brand. It doesn't have to be e.l.f. It can be anything. And let me tell you, honey. Oh my god, like, I have the hardest time with mascaras to keep my curl. It keeps my curl. It makes my lashes look longer, fuller. It just, it keeps them soft and conditioned. This has, like, vitamins and all kinds of good stuff in it. And I've noticed a difference in my lashes. I think it's actually improved my lashes. So, I highly recommend you guys check this out. This is the e.l.f. Primer Mascara. You can get this on their website. And then moving on to my absolute favorite mascaras right now. Um, I've got one from e.l.f. that I just purchased and I love it. I've been using this a lot. This is the 3-in-1 mascara. It's just amazing. I love this mascara. And you open it up and it has a wand. Just like this. It's very interesting. I've never had a wand like this before with a little ball on the end. It's like really weird. I'm absolutely loving this. And for $3, this is an amazing deal. My other favorite mascara is from Rimmel London, and this is the new one. This is the Scandalized Flex Mascara. Hush, and I love a thick mascara because I have such short, very sparse, very stubborn lashes, really. But love this. This is so affordable. It's under $6. Love it. Okay, so I know this is such a long video. I'm sorry, guys, but there's so many favorite things that I wanted to share with you guys. And these are my favorite three lip products. I'm going to start with this one. This is the 
my favorite like juicy tube type lipstick. This is from Wet n Wild and it's their, their glossy, what is it? Glassy gloss lip gels. And they look like this. So cute, love the packaging. They're like under $3, <laughs> so affordable. And it's just this really pretty, I'll just squeeze a little bit here. It's the perfect pinky um, color. Oh my God, look at that. It's just gorgeous. And I just love it. It smells, it smells so good. It, it smells like pink bubble gum. Okay, so I love, <laughs> I'm obsessed with like things that smell so good, especially lip products. This is from e.l.f. and these are the new jumbo lip gloss sticks. And I am just loving these and I kind of switch out which ones I like. But my favorite one is the one in pink umbrellas. And it's just the prettiest, softest pink color. Let's do a little swatch here. It's just the prettiest pink. I just love it. And it's so moisturizing. And it's got that nice minty smell. And it's just, oh, I just love it. I love mint around the holidays too. So definitely check these out. These are only like $3. I think they're like, no, they're $2. They're $2. They're $2 or $3. If you guys want to see my review on these, I will put the link down below so you can check out that video. Put thumbs up and all that good stuff. And last but not least, my favorite lipstick for the month of October. Maybelline Color Sensational lipstick and this is newly purchased but I had to put this in here I love 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 this this is in the shade magnificent mob it is the most beautiful lipstick I have ever seen in my life it's this beautiful purple violet color and I'll do a quick swatch here it's beautiful it's bold it's just so so pretty they're around $5.50 to $6 depending on where you go, but I always get these when they're on sale. I love this. Oh, it's my favorite lipstick. I've been like wearing it a lot. I'm not wearing it right now, but I love wearing this. Okay, guys, so that's it. Oh, I know it was a lot, a lot of stuff, but I had a lot of favorites for the month of October, and I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video. If you have done a video on your favorite things or your beauty obsessions for October, please do a response video because I would love to check out your guys' videos for that. Um, these videos are always so much fun to make and I absolutely love sharing my favorite things with you. So share your favorite things with me or you can leave a comment down below and tell me what is your favorite thing that you used for the month of October. So yeah, tell me your October favorite. So thanks guys for watching. Um, if you haven't subscribed to my channel, please subscribe. I will leave the links to my Facebook page and Twitter account down below so you can tweet it up with me or you can check out my Facebook page, put a like to it, and you can keep up to date with all my stuff. So I'll see you next time, guys. Remember, smarter beauty is better beauty. Bye!